The challenge is to eat sushi for 100 days straight for lunch and dinner. And if I use any fish, it has to be only sustainable fish, which means either Poland line caught or MSC certified. It was a cost saving experiment because one of the local uh, Japanese food retailers, uh, Banzai Oriental Supplies, posted a note on their Facebook page detailing how you could live on sushi for a month for under £100. So actually worked it out, it's actually a lot less than that. You can do it per month for about £30, just sushi. Well, most people associate sushi, when they think of sushi, they just think of fish. And you don't have to use fish at all. I mean, I'm on day 10 currently, and I've only used fish once out of the whole 10 days I've been doing it so far. I mean, you don't even have to use seaweed. I've even made sushi wrapped in, in uh, flour tortillas. Sushi is, the word sushi just means seasoned rice, and that's all you need for it to be classed as sushi, is the seasoned rice. I mean, recently though, there's you got, um, is it Red Ginger, the new restaurant? on Shamble Street, there's, I mean, I bought most of my sushi supplies locally as well from Barnsley Oriental Supplies down in Carlton. So there's, it's available in Barnsley, it's just people need to try it. Like I said, it's sushi for lunch and dinner, but in between I can have whatever else I want to sort of make up for anything that sushi lacks nutrition-wise. Well, it's, it's an experiment on three levels, so it's cost, healthiness and Efficalness, so only sustainable fish, and I'm raising money for the Marine Conservation Society, which if you do want to donate, you can go to justgiving.com slash 100 days of sushi.